Honestly, I don't care about you being cold. Because you only cold when you come out of your job. That's the only I'm time cold when I leave the house and come in here. It's freezing. Hey, here. guys. Oh, my God. Look at my... Is it ashy or is it shiny? Can't tell. Don't you dare. Oh, that's how you know the difference. Because the what? Was it the ash or what? Excuse me. Um, hey, guys. Hey, guys. We are about to review... Popeye's chicken nuggets finally. Ooh. Finally is right. I hate the smell of this. What is it? Love spell. Mm, moose bits. My um. mother put it in my car. But um Yeah, we decided that I guess we'll just do a video earlier in the week next week. Yeah. Um because other than Beyonce, which y'all know we can talk about Beyonce for that a whole be, show. That can be two show a two show part two, classic. We um don't really have that many topics. What so. if this ghetto one don't have it? Are they like, oh, we don't got no more? That would be so funny. <laughs> um, it is very hot outside today. No, it's, it's been hot all week. Very, very hot. It's like 99 degrees. Um, it really has me all types of fucked up. No, I'm enjoying it though. I'm not enjoying it. And then my hair isn't done, so it's like extra hot. It's just a lot going so I'm, I'm not enjoying it i feel like this weather makes me like really sluggish really drained really tired i don't want to do anything for some reason i keep having to be outside i just don't like it mm. that's what's happening over here oh no i like this it's like it's it's i mean it's annoying sometimes when you come outside and you be like <gasps> like you have to adjust your breathing because the air is so thick but Honestly and truly, I would rather be hot and sweating from my tits than to have to put on socks and a pair of leggings and a pair of boots. I would rather be drenched in sweat than to be cold. No, I'm actually looking forward to the fall. I I'm really that. looking forward to like hot chocolate, so you leggings, Uggs, cozy hats, my red. My only thing I want is my rat. That's the only thing. And you know what? At this point, a bitch will go get a perm. Like, I... See, I'm not even asking for, like, what you're referring to. Like, I'm not asking for 55. I'm asking for a when smooth... When it is 55 degrees outside, y'all come and check on y'all, girl. I'm asking I'm for a be smooth dead. 67. 69. Something like that. 67? Like where you? 72. No, like where you still need like a little jacket. I think that's 72. No, 72, you don't need no damn jacket. No, you absolutely, absolutely do need 72. If it's not humid, you need a little jacket. No. It's, diff the, it's difference between a fall 72 and a springtime 72. Oh, would you eat that strawberry shortcake? No. That strawberry cheesecake? No. Oh, it don't have strawberries in it? Mm-mm. No. You still don't want to try it? No, because uh, sometimes stuff like that, I don't like the seeds. What seeds? Sometimes it's seeds in the gel that they have. What kind of seeds? I guess it's from the strawberry. I don't like that. I don't know nothing about that. Yeah, no, I don't like that. This Popeye's is usually really fast. Yeah, it's ghetto here. Um, very, very, very ghetto. Because they don't let you spend a lot of time at the window at all. So that means like, that they either don't have something or they are or you see how this lady is right here, the person that moved, and she's still goddamn talking in the speaker. You don't even know what you want before you came here? It's only you Popeyes. Know, actually, this is the Popeyes that I've always lived by, like, my whole life. And this is the only Popeyes in Baltimore, county included, that does not, that did not have a drive -thru. They just got a drive through for the pandemic. Before they that, they didn't have it. just got a drive through and it's probably good because i probably would be like an extra hundred more pounds because there's been so many times that i wanted popeyes and i'll be like i'm not going inside yeah but because it's a drive through now now i'll just stop and i had to get myself together because i was on like a little because you know all y'all people that be like trying to go in like i saw somebody that just oh hold on one second somebody that just finally had the sandwich and they were like it's not even all that that's because you ain't get it at the tight no it's geeky I wonder what these chocolate beignets would taste like. Some of them mm. probably love them. I hate. I don't like chocolate inside of stuff like that. Mm -hmm. I got these chocolate croissants at my job. It's that's Simone loves them. I can eat one, 
but that's mm -mm. it. Like, I don't really. And the chocolate that's in it is so rich. Hi, do you have the nuggets? Um, What sizes do they come in or count? Um, Can I just have six? No, if he's it. The numbers. Oh, hold on. Wait, say it again. I'm sorry. See, the six piece nugget is the kids meal but this right here is number six and seven are eight piece and twelve pieces yeah i literally just want can i just buy a six piece by itself not the meal no. well can i just have an eight piece yeah, yeah, eight piece by that's fine um can i have sweet heat and um what other sauce do y'all have Oh yeah, give me a sweet heat and a um, black and ranch. I know how y'all about the sauces, so if I have to pay for the extra one, that's fine. That's it. He said you're talking too much. I don't care. That's it. Thank you. That black and ranch has 120 calories. That's the black crazy. and ranch is actually the one that they use for keto. Oh yay, Tanea's fan! Waiting for my refund back from the show. So, okay. Put it on the page. Take your sale. Sorry that that was in your face. It's okay. Notice my old car had so many of these. Are you going to keep on doing that? Or are you no, going to be throwing it in the trash? No, I'm throwing it. When I get my own car, I'm going to keep a collection. Right. And I've been thinking about getting different ones. You know how you have the little trees? I've been thinking about getting like maybe the square one that they sell at Fast and Body Works. have a whole little show up here. Mm -mm. No, I actually want some pictures. You remember back in the day you used to have little mall pictures hanging right here? I want that. With the little one. Mm -hmm. Tiffany, you have pictures everywhere. It's just like... I don't anymore. When Tiffany dies, it's just like... If I be still alive, I'm going to have so... Yep, yeah, I'm just wanting you to know right now. That little book that you get when you die, baby, got your back. Because I'm going to put so many pictures in there. I'm going to make it really, really nice. I'm going to have one page. It's going to be like a booklet. Like a, it's going to be a, a pamphlet. My favorite conversation. My it's going to be very, very nice. So, my I just want you to know that I have your back. Thank you. You're welcome. Um, yeah, this video is going to be quick. It actually wouldn't be this long if this Yeah, it's probably, the, the taste is. test is probably going to be less. But um, <laughs> one of my good friends, HB, he was saying that no YouTubers have really did like a taste test on the... My thing is, I want to know if they taste like the, the tenders. Because I'm not a big fan of their tenders. Not the fried ones anyway. I actually like the black and ones better. Those fried ones just, they just don't seem really seasoned to me. Mm, I mean, I can agree with the season part, but I like the crunch. The crunch is nice, but it's just like, I'm actually eating chicken. See, Tanez, you've been having an issue with Popeyes anyway, so you don't count. Also, I don't like if this, if y'all notice the cut of the chicken tenders. It just makes it really, really chickeny. Chickeny? Yeah, it's like I'm really biting into flesh. <sighs> no, I can just already tell. I kind of think that it might be like the tenders, but I'm telling y'all for some reason, I really feel like these nuggets are not new. They not new. We've had them for a long time. I feel like I've had them before. I mean, not unless they've been cutting up tenders here and been selling them, but... But it's not something that I've... I think I've tasted them before, but I don't know. Yeah, egg nuggets. Mm-hmm. Thank you. This whole Popeye's is ran by Africans. Hey, black and and Yeah. Mm -hmm. What in the world? The black and ranch is cool. The black and ranch is fine. No, thank you. No. Oh, you know what? I'll try the I'll try the honey mustard. That's fine. That honey mustard is weird. Crazy. If I would, thank, thank you. you. If this wasn't for a taste tester, we would have drove off. Oh, I would have flipped out. I'm not eating my pie pies without no fucking black, I mean, without no sweet heat. Y'all know, people really think it's me. Tiffany is really the problematic one. I'm not problematic. So it's just like. But keep it the fuck real. Where are you going? This is an exit only. This is an exit only. You know what? Bye. Yeah.
time. Just want to pull over somewhere really quickly so we can taste these and head home because we're actually having spaghetti for dinner. Yeah. But this makes sense because y'all know we have spaghetti and fried chicken. Yeah. I'm excited. Not really, but you know, it is what it is. So, sorry, got a little dark. Y'all can really see my tan, right? Yeah, we can. This is the eight piece. It smells like Popeye. Very crunchy. Looks very, very crunchy. Okay, this way you get the black and ranch. I am pissed. This is the wild honey mustard. Oh, hopefully it's different because the honey mustard. See, that's the other thing. Like, I never like Popeye's sauces. It's egg yolks in this. So here's one. It looks like the like broken up tenders. Come on, you take it. I'm sorry. Sometimes I think it's something. All right, let's see. Very crunchy. I like that. What's going on? Here? I like the like ranch. Okay. Honey Little mustard. dipper roux for you. I would enjoy them way more with a different sauce. Mm -hmm. Very crunchy. Very crunchy. But again, they taste just like the tenders. They're not really seasoned. Like, extremely crunchy. I like it. I like how crunchy they are. Mm-hmm. Definitely need to be the sweet heat. Mm-hmm. I don't cry with your ranch. Yeah, the thing about it is they need to season these like they season the chicken sandwich. I'm gonna try it with the honey mustard. I fucked with the black and rice, but the black and rice tastes so good with the black and tender. Like, they are match me in heaven. Definitely sweet at this point. Oh, no, they changed their honey mustard. You know, because they, Popeyes is all about spice. Their honey mustard used to have like spices in it. I thought that, well, it said wild honey. So I thought it was going to be a little spicy, but it's not really. It's the honey is wild, not the mustard. No, I would recommend them. I went, uh, I went and waited in line like I did for the sandwich for these. Mm mm. Mm mm. I definitely do, wouldn't do that, but. They had a little five dollar deal going on for those. Well, that's not bad. Nothing bad to get for lunch. Eight piece biscuit and fries and a drink for this for five dollars. Uh, to me, unless they have sweet, I would be enjoying the fries and the biscuit way more than I enjoy these. What are you rating them? I want to give them like a a seven or a six. Like I would give them an eight. An eight. Mm -hmm. That's because Tiffany eats no salt, so that's this is a she doesn't so is the seasoning for you. She doesn't mind this boy in life. Yes, <laughs> it's like I'm eating like a chick like chicken. It's like I'm eating chicken. It doesn't. There's no seasoning. Where is the seasoning, Jan? <laughs> What's the lady name, Papa? I don't know. Okay, they got her name. But yeah, no, it's just. They ain't, you know that she now on the commercial. They ain't let her do these. Cause these don't have no damn seasoning. I mean, it's not really like seasoning, but it's like for me, and this is with all things. If I put sauce on it, like I really don't even care no more. That's because you you like bland food, so it's okay. That's not true. It is. Um, I would give them an eight. I would definitely. I'm giving them a six or seven just because I know with seasoning and the right sauce they could definitely be an eight or nine because i love the crunch mm -hmm. i love the size i love that they weren't soggy i love that they're real and not sponges so like those type of things are giving it you know take it up there but it's just like i'm eating unseasoned chicken i would never eat unseasoned chicken <laughs> if i bit into a piece of unseasoned chicken i would spit it out so it's just like Seasoning your batter is not enough. Well, guys. You got to season that chicken. I would definitely give it like a six or a seven. Uh, um, 
I see why a lot of people have reviewed it though. Mm -hmm. But I will tell you this. Chick-fil-A still reigns superior. Absolutely. Because let me tell you something. If I don't have no sauce, if, which Chick-fil-A never really does, if Chick-fil-A forgets my sauce, I can still eat the nuggets mm -hmm. or the tenders because they still taste good. Would you want to eat that with no sauce? Mm -mm. Yeah, like, no. Mm -mm. And the other day, Kari had a 30 piece and she only had Polynesian. I was like, ugh, I hate Polynesian. It's just too sweet. And um, I was just like eating pop, me eating the fucking nuggets like it was popcorn. Yeah, like no, like, they're lit. They were so good. So yeah, I'm gonna say I'm gonna say Chick Fil A. And for me, I'll take Wendy's nuggets over McDonald's. I mean, that's just me. That's where I'm at. The thing about it is, if McDonald's no, no, hell especially no. those goddamn spicy ones. You want to talk every about get, seasoning? Wendy's nuggets are fucking seasoned. No, every time I get no, they are seasoned. But I'm just saying because of the inside of the nugget, it's, to me, it's the same as McDonald's. But um, those see the last time I got nuggets from Wendy's, they were the spicy ones. And I don't know what had been going on, but them motherfuckers was not fresh. I can tell you that they were. Well, you know, I don't know about this is like where y'all at too. Wendy's is always a hit on this. Yeah, no, Wendy's is all. I see. I had stopped. I had, I had to stop eating Wendy's because I got a grilled chicken from there twice, and each time I got it, it was still raw on the inside. Mm -hmm. So I had to stop fucking with them. Yeah, but so I would say get you a white piece, white two piece. Well, I know y'all eat dog meat. Get y'all a little two piece. Get y'all fries. I would, I would, I would say before I ordered this, even with it being on the sale, I would get whatever chicken they had on sale. To as me. long as they have the sweet heat, I would get the nuggets. Yeah, but it's just like I would have to ask first. Do you guys have sweet heat? Oh, oh know, okay. Because it's been a while, but I usually will. If you don't have the sweet heat, I don't need money. Yeah, so. But it's so crazy because their little shrimp that they be having on sale are so seasoned. I don't know no, they be. are, they are seasoned. I like them, those little shrimp. Yeah, they're good. So guys, I mean, I'm recommending that you try them if you just want to try them. But I'm not saying hurry up and go taste them. Yeah, like, it's nothing like the chicken sandwich. But if you want crunchy, yeah. I mean, it, it, it got, it the, got crunch. the crunch. It's a crunchy nugget. I'll tell you that. But it's not a really. You know what? You can actually take these home and you not know people like you most know of those they wing shops they toss around there. Yeah, I was gonna say if you took these home and made like some like sauce to toss them in mm -hmm. that would be really really good, be really yeah. good. Mm -hmm. yeah so i hope you guys have a great weekend we will be back early next week early. So, i'm saying early because y'all know we'll be doing like thursday and friday yeah. videos but we're going to try to do like a monday or tuesday video um hopefully nothing too crazy happens over the weekend yeah you guys stay in stay hydrated it's hot everywhere i thought it was just you know it's like some type of heat wave going so y'all stay safe and we'll see you guys next week. Oh, if you I was saying peace out. If you didn't know, now you know it's no show like the show. But you gotta go. We're finally home. <laughs>